Incredibles House Church yeah. and the special ops Bible talk. <laughs> so grateful to be able to um, um, so grateful to be able to um, introduce uh, this baptism this afternoon, especially after an amazing um, film. I know I'm feeling a lot, so I'm hoping to get through this. Um, but um, this is Josephine. Come on, Josephine. Come on, Josephine. And, um, and I'm actually going to allow uh, Jasmine and Montserrat to uh, share um, about Josephine. So this time I'll give you guys Josephine. Hi, everybody. Hello. Okay, so I'm so excited. Uh, if you know anything about Josephine, um, she and I, we met on my birthday a few months ago um, in an Uber. July 3rd is our anniversary. <laughs> <laughs> um, it took about three months to the day that we met to actually sit down and do a Bible study. And I, I just think the scripture is really fitting, Josephine. And so it's in Acts 17. Oh, no, that's not the one that I wanted to share. It's in Acts 8. There it is. Acts 8. And it says, uh, this is the story of Philip and the Ethiopian eunuch. And then it says in verse 34, <clears throat> the eunuch asked Philip, tell me please, who is the prophet talking about, himself or someone else? Then, the Philip, then Philip began with that very passage of scripture and told him the good news about Jesus. As they traveled along the road, they came to some water. The eunuch said, look, here is water. What can stand in the way of my being baptized? And he gave orders to stop the chariot. Then both Philip and the eunuch went down into the water, and Philip baptized him. When they came out of the water, the spirit of the Lord suddenly took Philip away, and the eunuch did not see him again, but went on his way rejoicing. <laughs> and so um, I, it's just been a, an incredible honor to be here with you. Um, to be on your chariot ride, to say, here's water, and this is my last time with you guys um, in Southland. Um, it's just been an honor and a joy. I hope that you just remember who your king is, you know, what he's done for you. He's done so much. He loves you so much, and you just, you've yet to live the best part of your life. And I'm just honored to call you my sister today, and I love you. It's such an honor just to, to walk with you. Um, it's, it's been an awesome three months to just see your heart transform. Um, even in the midst of the studies, you stop and you're like, actually, I kind of want to share something and what just happened today, and I feel a little convicted. Um, and just really you going after it. And, um, you know, that moment that you called me, that day that you, you know, you had your your accident and you and you called and I was like wow like your your hunger to really seek the kingdom um, stop worrying about what other people were doing in your life um, to really go after it so I'm just so grateful I'm excited um, I love how you know it's gonna be a challenge but we're gonna be here with you so yeah I love you so much and I'm excited <laughs> we're beyond to be on it Oh, go ahead. My bad. I'm going to let Joe share. Um, yeah, um, kind of overwhelmed right now. Um, these women have so, shown me so much love, um, more love than I've ever had from strangers before. Um, and I was really like, I wanted to know more about the church that they came from because, like, Monster came at like, what was it, like 2, 3, 4 o'clock <coughs> in the morning to come pick me up from the hospital. Um, and just like constantly, Jasmine's always, you know, every time I was like, no, like, I don't know, you know, trying to run away. They were just kept showing me love, like over and over again. And I was like, these people don't even know me, but they're showing me so much love. I want to share um, a verse. It's from John 15, uh, verse 9, and it says, As the Father has loved me, so have I loved you. Now remain in my love. Yeah. If you keep my commands, you will remain in my love, just as I love my Father's commands and remain in his love. 
I have told you this so that my joy may be in you and that your joy may be complete. Mm -hmm. My command is this, love each other as I loved you. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, you guys have all shown me so much love and I can't wait to be part of this kingdom and call, I'll call you guys brothers and sisters. That's right. <laughs> So I have three of two of the most important questions that you have ever asked in your life. Do you believe that Jesus is the Son of God? That yeah. he came to this earth, lived a sinless life, died for your sins and murdered them every day? Yes. And that is a good confession. Jesus is Lord. <laughs> Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, the name of the water. Um, all of your sins will be forgiven, washed right away, and you'll be added to the book of life. Amen. And you'll receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Oh. Oh. All the way down. 